From heated showdowns to some of the craziest fights in football history, these are moments football players lost control. Starting off, a ball is played into the box, but the keeper is not having it. A jab straight into his opponent's face! <laughs> the manager can't believe his eyes. The ref gave the manager a stern warning, but wait, he's not having it either! He's off! The manager can't believe it, asking the fourth official, really? Yep. It's a red card, and whoa, he's going berserk, shirt ripping and all. Check out those tattoos as he storms off like a raging bull. I guess subtlety isn't his style, huh? <laughs> now Ross Barkley steps onto the pitch for Everton, ready for action. But hold up, he's a one-man wrecking crew out there, fouling left and right. Look at him getting all up in Emre Chan's grill. Tempers flare and both lads are seeing yellow. Talk about a heated exchange. Remember the infamous Zidane moment in the 2006 World Cup final? France versus Italy and Zidane's the man to watch. But Marco Materazzi's getting too close for comfort. Zidane's had enough, offers his jersey, and Materazzi snaps back with a nasty comment and boom. Zidane headbutts him right in the chest. Gigi Buffon's like, dude, why has the French rushed to defend their man? Red card for Zidane, and it's a tragic exit for this football legend. Copa America 2019, Argentina vs Chile, Messi and Gary Medel are at it, and it's a showdown. Messi shoves and Medel seeing red, literally, pushes and a near headbutt, it's chaos. Both get red cards and it's an all out brawl. South American football, never a dull moment. Over to the Italian league, AC Milan's got a corner against Lazio, Mark Van Bommel's in the mix, but Andre Diaz thinks it's boxing, not football. A sneaky punch and Van Bommel's down. What a dirty play. US versus Mexico, always a fiery matchup. 2023 Nations League semi-final, and it's living up to the hype. Cesar Montes gets robbed by Balogun and lashes out with a nasty kick. It's a straight red and things are getting wild. American players are on the hunt, especially Weston McKinney. Shirt ripped and all, trying to keep his cool. Too late, buddy, you're seeing red too. And who could forget Luis Suarez's chomp in the 2014 World Cup? Uruguay versus Italy and Suarez decides to take a bite out of Giorgio Chiellini. Then he hits the deck, acting like he's the one hurt. Chiellini showing off the bite mark and Suarez is playing the victim. Only in football, dude. <laughs> In a Brazil versus Portugal friendly, Neymar's on a break, but Pepe shoves him right into keeper Rui Patricio. It's chaos as Pepe clears the ball, accidentally dropping his own keeper. Ref's quick to slap Neymar with a yellow. Talk about being in the wrong place at the wrong time. Pepe's totally focused on Neymar, not even seeing Patricio dash out. What a mix up. Now Vinicius Jr. is all set to dance past Valencia's Gabriel. But whoa, he gets a nasty late kick instead. Vinicius is fuming, demanding red, and guess what? He gets his wish. Gabriel's off with a red card. Over in La Liga, Atletico Madrid versus Barcelona turns into a WWE match. Ferran Torres and Stefan Savic ditch the ball for a chokehold contest. Savic's got a grip and Ferran's pulling hair. They finally break apart, but man, what a scuffle. Rodri's got the ball, but here comes Fabinho with a dodgy tackle. No ball, all legs. Rodri's livid and Gundogan's shoving Fabinho to the ground. It's a tug of war with Rodri, City, and Liverpool players all jumping in. Now the Inter Milan-Juventus rivalry is heating up. Inter's got a late penalty and Lukaku's eyeing a point against Juve. Juve fans are booing like crazy, but Lukaku's nerves are steel. He scores and cheekily taunts the Juve fans. Post-game, Quadrado confronts Lukaku, and it's pushing match time. They're ready to take it backstage. Atletico Nacional versus Rosario Central in the Copa Libertadores, and Berrios just scored a last-minute winner. He's taunting Rosario keeper Sebastian Sosa, and it's an instant melee. Players, staff, everyone's in it. Atletico Nacional's having the last laugh, moving on in the tournament. Luis Suarez is at it again, it's 2013, and he's biting Ivanovic. 
frustration turns to fangs for Suarez, who goes full vampire mode on Ivanovic's arm. El Clasico, always fiery, even in friendlies. Vinicius goes down, words fly with Sergio Bosquets. Meanwhile, Rudiger and Araujo are in each other's faces. No love lost in El Clasico, friendly or not. Reese James versus Nuno Tavares? It's a shove fest. James isn't playing nice, pushing Shaka, who's just trying to cool things down. There's always heat at Chelsea Arsenal. Arsenal's own Alexander loses it at training, grabbing Cedric's face. Cedric's not taking it, and teammates rush in. Teammates are not, tempers flare. In Atlas vs Pumas, it's a bicycle kick gone wrong. Pumas' Juan Dineno accidentally boots an Atlas player's face. It's a knockout hit, Dineno's sent off, and the medics are in. Ouch! <laughs> and here's Cristiano Ronaldo, panicking like he's in a game of dodgeball instead of football. Man, he goes full volleyball mode, slapping the ball away from his face. Realizing his oopsie, he turns to the ref, begging for mercy. But the ref's not buying what Ronaldo's selling, and bam! It's a second yellow card for the Portuguese star. You can almost hear him saying, dang, I should have just taken the hit. <laughs> Pipe Reina for Liverpool gets tripped by a Newcastle player and loses it. He goes head to head, literally with a Newcastle player. Boom, headbutt, and Reina's shown a red. That's two Liverpool players sent off at Newcastle in one clip. <laughs> Mattia Perrin decides to go full linebacker on an opposing striker, pushing him to the ground before clearing the ball. The ref's quick to give Perrin the red, and he's ready to take on anyone after that call. Watch out for Perrin's temper! <laughs> Marcelo from Lyon can't believe it when he gets a yellow. He's so shocked that he accidentally flicks the card out of the ref's hand. Oops, too late for sorries. The ref sends him off, leaving Marcelo probably wishing he had less impulsive movements. In a Sheffield United vs Brentford match, the Sheffield keeper trying to burn the clock after a free kick, the Brentford player, not in the mood for games, tries to snatch the ball, but the keeper's holding it just out of reach, and both players end up seeing red. Talk about a slapstick showdown! Over at Swansea City, time wasting reaches new heights with a ball boy guarding the ball like it's the last one on earth. A desperate hazard swoops in, trying to wrangle the ball free, but ends up kicking right under the kid. Oof, it looks rough as the kid takes a hit. The Swansea squad rushes to the ball boy's aid while Hazard gets slapped with a red. Ever get so fed up with being fouled that you just snap? The West Brom player sure did. He grabs the ball and boots it with pinpoint accuracy right at the dude who's been yanking his chain. Sure, it's a straight send-off, but you've got to admire that aim, right? Talk about a frustration foul turned into an epic, albeit illegal, clapback. <laughs> if you enjoyed the video, I bet you'll enjoy this other one. See you there.